NXT pay-per-view schedule for 2018. Alexis Carrillo here, back in the Alexis Carrillo brand YouTube channel, back with some more content, wrestling talk, content for the wrestling fan, and this time it's time to go into the pay-per-view schedule, the big events that NXT has lined up for us in 2018, and practically I can confirm these as official because as you know, WWE being the big dog that it, that it is, they can confirm their dates a year in advance because they have no real competition in the United States of America. And with that also includes not only Raw, SmackDown, and 205 Live, but also its developmental brand, brand sorry, its farm system, NXT. Now, as you may know, there are going to be five co-branded pay-per-view events in 2018, uh, those being... Uh, both Raw and SmackDown pay-per-view events, but that also includes that the night before, or in the case of WrestleMania, two nights before, we have the big NXT TakeOver events. We start on uh, January 27th in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, the night before the Royal Rumble pay-per-view with NXT TakeOver Philadelphia, which, if I'm not mistaken, will have the main event be Andrade Cien Almas, defending his NXT Championship against Johnny Gargano. And I know a lot of you NXT fans are hoping that Tommaso Ciampa will return and reignite the feud that started uh, last year in one of the late TakeOver events. Uh, we will just have to see if that happens, if Tommaso Ciampa returns. But if he does indeed return, I would like to have him, uh, you know, be the main event of NXT TakeOver New Orleans, so, you know, two nights before WrestleMania. That would be a big main event, an emotional main event, and a main event that people and NXT fans can really get invested instead of, you know, continuing with Andrade Cien Almas as the NXT champion, which hasn't been doing a, a terrible job at it. But I, I think, you know, NXT should have... Uh, a better champion, you know, a, a higher profile feud, and and leave uh, Andrade Cien Almas still to develop more his character and his wrestling skills. Now, we talked about that NXT TakeOver event in New Orleans. That will be April 6th. Then we won't have until, we won't have another event until June 16th. NXT TakeOver Chicago. Really looking forward to this one. Chicago, Illinois being one of the rowdiest crowds wrestling crowds in the in the uh, in the country so really looking forward to what kind of atmosphere it can bring and then the night before SummerSlam August 18th NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 4 which is practically like NXT's WrestleMania it is NXT's tradition it is NXT's uh, uh, marquee event uh, if you were to brand it that way so you could expect big things, big matches, great matches can always be expected at these NXT TakeOver Brooklyn events. The fourth one to take place on August 18th. And then we close out the year on November the 17th with NXT TakeOver War Games 2. Really looking forward to this one as well. Hopefully they have a more traditional War Games, ma war games match where it'll be one team versus another team instead of having a three-way team War Games match, which... Uh, I, I didn't feel quite worked well for the concept. They did the best that they could, but hopefully they, they, they transition it to a more traditional one-on-one -on -one team match at, at, at War Games 2 on November 17th, the night before Survivor Series. But hey, I want to hear what your thoughts. What are you looking for? What event are you looking forward on the NXT calendar in 2018? Hit the comment section below, and uh, if you're in, and if you're looking for any more wrestling talk content, you can find it right here on the Alexis Carrillo brand channel. Make sure to subscribe. Uh, that's it for me on this video. Thanks. Until next time.